Hi everyone, so I am back. It has been a very long time since I've been on YouTube. <laughs> a lot has definitely changed in my life, which I will go into in another video that I have planned very shortly. But today I'm going to do a review, as you can tell by the title, with Alaya Skincare. So today I'm going to be reviewing the Australian Pink Clay Mask by Alaya Skin. <laughs> this little beauty. So it claims to detoxify and brighten your skin, suitable for sensitive skin, tightens your skin's pores, extracts pollutants and nasties from your skin, helps reduce inflammation caused by acne and eczema, there's no parabens or harsh chemicals in the product either and the best part is it's vegan and cruelty free which I love in skincare. No one wants perfume and chemicals in their skincare the more natural the product, the better for your skin in my eyes. So this is why I was really excited to try this product out. Another thing to mention is they do have a 30 day money back guarantee and it's free worldwide shipping, which again is very unusual for a company. So that was also a good benefit if you do decide to order this and try it out yourself. I stick to my same face mask, which is either Glam Glow, I love the L'Oreal face mask as well, and the Garnier sheet mask are always my go-to's and once you kind of find a product it's hard to switch it. It is hard to try things out when you know something works for your skin but Elias Skin were very generous and gifting me this to see what I think so I'm excited to get going and let's try this out. This is what the pink clay mask looks like. I'm just going to pop this on my face. It says to do a thick layer Excuse the state of my hair. I can see I have flyaways. In the UK, we're currently going through a heat wave and it is humid as hell. In the UK, we just don't deal well with heat. <laughs> Especially someone so pale like me. I struggle bad. Okay, this is not very glamorous, this part. I'm just putting a thick layer on with my finger. It does smell really nice. I don't know, it has like a real, really unique scent. I can't actually pinpoint what it is. No. I mean, it mainly smells of clay, but it does have a unique scent. It says to obviously avoid eyebrows and the eye area, and it did say T-zone, but I'm just gonna put it all over. It's normally what I do with a face mask. I don't tend to need a lot on my forehead, so I'm just gonna pop it in the centre. There we go. Very sexy. <laughs> so I'm gonna leave this on for 10 minutes like instructed. I will come back in 10 minutes and let you know how it feels on my skin as it's been drying and um, if there's any sensations. My last face mask video didn't go to plan. The first time I used Glam Glow, it actually burnt my skin. Hoping this does it. So I'm back, it's been 10 minutes and my skin feels amazing. It actually feels really soothing as it dries down. It hasn't actually gone how I thought it would. Clay normally dries down quite hard and it cracks. Um, haven't done that. It actually just is like a really thick yogurt consistency still, like in the jar. It hasn't actually dried down. Like it's still tacky to touch. But I'm gonna go and wash it off now and let's hope that my skin is looking brightened and detoxified. So I've washed the mask off now and I have to say I'm really impressed. My skin definitely has more of a matte finish now compared to before when I used the mask. So it's definitely detoxified and drawn out all the oils and things like that. I know I need to stop touching my skin, but it feels so smooth and it feels really soothing and fresh, really fresh. And then you notice you still have masks on your face. My skin definitely looks really glowy and brightened and it feels so fresh. So it's definitely detoxified and drawn all the oils and things out of my skin. I can feel that already. I know my skin feels really amazing, like really fresh and rejuvenized. I think it looks really glowy and bright. So I definitely say this mask works. It's a really, really lovely mask to use. Not how I thought it would be with clay. I'm used to clay masks drying down. This doesn't dry down, but I guess then it doesn't dry your skin out. It's, yeah, I'm really happy with the results. It's really beautiful. So it says on the tub here that if you post a photo of you using the products and tag them on Instagram, you can be in the chance every month to win a big bundle by the company. So definitely do that if you purchase. You might get lucky. And if you want to purchase this, I will pop a discount code that I've been kind of given 
for my followers in the description box below. But I love this and I definitely think you should check them out. If you've been seeing, like me, the pink mask floating about on Instagram or you want to try something new with your skincare, definitely recommend this. And if you do try it out, let me know below your thoughts and if you loved it or didn't like it. So thanks guys for watching and I guess I'm back now on YouTube. So hopefully there'll be more videos uploaded. So make sure you hit that subscribe button below and let's have some fun on here again. Hope you all have an amazing day and I'll see you soon.